Hello everybody and welcome to the first video of my new Python for Beginners course. This course is meant for absolute beginners, so if you don't know any programming or you're not familiar with Python, then this course is for you. In this video we're going to talk about what Python is, why you should learn Python, how to install it, and at last we're going to create a simple program in Python. So why should you learn Python? Well, Python is a very simple language, so it's easy to learn for beginners. And it's also a very practical language and it's used by many big companies like Google, Facebook, Spotify, Netflix and many many more. Uh, Python is also a very popular language and it's mostly used for server-side applications, big data analysis and machine learning. Before we begin, who am I? Well, I am DevShell, I am a programming enthusiast and I'm here to teach you about various programming languages and computer science topics. So stay tuned for that. To install Python, head, head down to python.org. Go to this download section and uh, click the button. Then you'll need an IDE. IDE stands for Integrated Development Environment. And that basically means software to help you write software. PyCharm in this case is a, it's just a piece of software that's going to help you to write Python code. Click on this download button. Then scroll down. You'll see here PyCharm Community Edition. Just download that and you'll be ready to go. Once you've installed PyCharm, open PyCharm and then click on New Project. Then on the top, you can type the project name. In this case, it's Hello World. And uh, this can be anything you want. So uh, feel free to change that. Uh, and then just cre click Create. So now your Python project should be ready to go. You'll see here some pre-generated Python code. Just select all of that and delete it. And now we can start writing our Python code. Type print, then braces, then add quotes, double or single quotes. It doesn't really matter in Python. And then type hello world. Now we're done with our program. And to run it, click this green button, this run button. And then you'll see here hello world. So this program prints hello world. In the next video, we're going to go into some more detail. So stay tuned for that. And I'll see you in the next video.